Hello there and welcome to Wordscapes Gameplay. Been a while since I did a video and haven't played on this too much. So I'm going to get started here and collect this little reward I got. This is from the, I believe, the wildlife. What is it? Wildlife. And you see, this is, this is all the wildlife that you can get. I've only got a couple so far. And a little jay or whatever he is, a little bird, is a blue jay. And as he plays or whatever he's doing, he earn more rewards. And you can click this and see you're going to get 75 hearts and four brilliance by letting him play. And that's really what the use of this is. These are ads. I'll pause this while this ad's running, but the ads give you rewards. And I'll show you the reward when I finish. And just by way of explanation, this is the Daily Booster. Relatively new thing. What they do with this is you watch three ads and you boost your gems. The first ad gives you plus five. The second ad's going to give you plus... 10 for 30 minutes. First ad is plus 5 for 15 minutes. And then this one, this third one is plus 20 for 90 minutes. So you can choose to watch one or two or all of them or none of them. Uh, but it's nice to get a little reward, a little extra gems. And that helps you with the wildlife. So that's what that's about. And I'll pause this as I run through these ads. I don't want to bore you with those. Okay, as you can see, I ran all of these ads. And now I have 90 minutes of playtime where I'll get plus 20 gems for every level that I complete in that 90 minutes. Here's another bonus, a daily reward. There's a lot of things going on in Wordscapes, just little bonuses and things you can do. And then this is an additional bonus. If I watch this ad, I'll get a bigger bonus gift. And we'll take a look at that. And again, I'll pause during the ad and be right back. Okay, I've collected my reward and I'm back. A couple of other points I'll show you. Here is where I can change my profile. Uh, I have to start a crown portrait or butterfly collection before I can do that. So we'll eventually get there. Here I can join a team. Teams are useful in tournaments. You get more rewards. Your team, your entire team can get rewards. Uh, uh, currently, I would have to join a fairly low rated team, most likely. Uh, newer players, because I'm at a low level relatively at this time so we'll wait and unlock the profile and do things like that a little later also here i've got an egg it's 850 heart gems to crack the egg and open it i only have 424 so we're gonna have to wait i'll get more when the blue jay finishes what he's doing and I get a few when I play now I'll get 20 at this time for every level so I'm going to get started and do some more levels here's pest whoops and pet and pets
here we have, I'm going to show you, I don't know if I've shown this before or explained this. We have, it says free, and you will get a gift. You do have to watch an ad. I think I might have already shown this, but I'll do it one more time. And we start the ad like this, and they'll generally run five ads. If you want to watch five, you can just watch one at a time. Usually, if I get stumped in a puzzle, which happens once in a while, I'll go watch an ad just to get my eyes off the puzzle and take a brief intermission and come back. And sometimes I can see right away what I was missing before. So anyway, you click watch, and here you go with another ad, and I'll pause for this. I'm back. I've received my reward now. It's 20 coins. We'll continue on. We'll play a little more. Dome is a good word because you can now get mode. You can get demo. So three words out of the same letters. And you learn to find those things pretty quickly. There's a lot of repetition. Uh, Words are repeated, and later on, very late, uh, very much later on, you'll see, occasionally, you'll see two puzzles in a row that are the same. I don't know if it's an error in the way the puzzles are or what it is. And you keep seeing these pop-ups trying to get me to buy things. You can, you can reduce those some by paying, I think it's 5 or $6 to basically reduce the ads. It's all it does. It used to it used to be a little better. It used to have the ads come on, like the ones I watched to get the rewards. They just pop up, and then you could pay to get that to stop. Now those don't pop up anymore, I don't think. At least they haven't so far in this account. Now I have another account where I'm much more advanced than this. Uh, I'm a slow player, though, so I just take my time. It's a good game for people like me that are getting a little older. I used to be a big-time gamer. Uh, played some different types of first-person shooters, and racing games were my big, my favorite for a lot of years, and still are, and I still participate in those, but the reaction time is just not as good. And sometimes it's hard to be competitive when you just aren't quite as fast as you used to be. In a game like this, speed only really counts in tournaments. If you're going to play in tournaments, it's better if you can play relatively fast. Uh, and sometimes, sometimes I do okay in tournaments. But usually I don't I don't finish really I, you know every once in a while I'll win my my personal tournament. And what the game does with the tournament is it puts you in with a hundred people, and I believe they're just chosen at random. And there's a lot involved in planning that, and it's we'll get into that later. And basically, on weekends, you just kind of slip into a tournament once you're eligible. And here's my profiles available now, it looks like. I got portraits, which is just the only one I've got is this little bunny rabbit right now. I got that. I don't have any crowns. Crowns are earned in tournaments. So I'm at zero. And I got a ways to go. This tournament ends on March 8th, so I probably won't get a very good crown for this one. I may be eligible this weekend to play in a tournament. We'll see. But it helps to play faster in tournaments. That's how you you win. And you win your, your individual tournament. And in essence, it's how you win your team tournaments. You have to, the team has to, at least have some members who can play pretty fast 
And usually that involves people that have been playing for some time. So of course in tournaments you're playing against other teams in the team tournaments and in uh, the individual tournament tournament you are of course playing against other individuals and it really boils down to how fast you can play uh, and it seems like it wouldn't make that much difference how much experience you have, but it's surprising how fast some people that are experienced can play. And I know that even though I'm still not very fast, I'm a lot faster than I was when I had less experience. My speed is picked up uh, on my regular account. I play with a very good team, and at some point, after I get this uh, this account up a little higher and show you some more things that come up later, I'll just go ahead and switch over to my regular account, and that way we can, I might do that this weekend, we'll see. That way you can see the more advanced tournament play and things of that nature. And if there's something you want to see, if you have any questions, you can always leave a comment in the doohickey below the comment section. And you see, these just keep popping up. And I do believe they are less, much less frequent if you pay the five or six dollars. So that's up to you. If you want to pay, you know, probably worth it. Makes things move a little faster in, in a tournament. It may help you because you don't want to be slow, always clicking something to get it out of the way, you know. Okay, let's see what I've got here. But no, uh, miss. There it is. Mm. Somewhat unusual words here. Getting a little more tricky as I advance through the levels. Bigger puzzles, more words. And eventually we'll get to where most puzzles won't have any three-letter words. Some still will, and it'll tell you if there are no three-letter words. It'll have a little thing down here on your picture, I think, on your avatar. But I'm going to keep playing. I've got 750 now on this, so I'm about 100 away. Oh, here's 75 right here. So that'll put me at 827. Also give me a little more brilliance. Now, since I've got binoculars over here, this is uh, another game. Uh, it's, it's a snowpack right now, a winter game, and they change in, in different seasons. Snowpack will probably run maybe for the rest of the winter. They might switch to something else in a few weeks, a couple weeks. I don't know. But what most people generally call it the binocular game. And you spot different animals in the, in the binocular game with your binoculars, and you collect them as you spot them. So I'm going to switch. If I can, I'm going to look. Actually, there's not really anything to switch to. You can see, if you look at all this wildlife in here, you see there's a binocular here. It looks like an elephant, I think. But it's locked. We can't get to it. It's grayed out, so to speak. We have to play more and collect these. 
And a way to do that is get the heart gems and continue to collect. So we'll stick with the blue jay until we get an animal. If we can get some wildlife that'll bring us binocular points, I guess you'd say, uh, we'll switch. But currently, it's not there. You see, everything is still is still uh, three letters, three and four letters, a lot of three letter words. Got another rabbit. And yes, it gives you a free gift for duplicates. So the rabbit that I got added points on my binocular game. Doesn't add a whole lot, but it, it does add up over time. And I think that's one of the fun things about this game is things add up over time. Sometimes you might not see immediate results. It's just interesting to watch things add up. Eight and eat. Okay, these. this is another interesting word. You got eight, which I already got. And you got eat. And you got tea. All right. And then you've also got, you got three words out of those three letters. So they're using every combination. Here's a word that's not too common. Teal. Oh, I've already got that. It's a bonus word here. I will get one coin for each bonus word. Probably already been through this, but I don't remember. Alt is considered a word. Ale is a word. And axe. Axle spelled this way and axle spelled this way. And the first one, A-X-E-L, was a bonus word. So I've already built four coins out of bonus words. And that's where you get a lot of your coins because four or five or six or even two or three bonus words in, in, a, in each puzzle adds up. It's another thing that adds up over time. And it's where a lot of these coins have come from. I got two, 2,394. So well, that's pretty good. And you get some for this, of course. Usually you get coins. Sometimes you get a, a hint, which is even better because that's worth 100 coins. Or the rocket right here is worth 300 coins, so that's a good one to have. I've got two rockets. I'm just holding on to those. Really, uh, a lot of times it's good to hold on to things like that and look look to use. Most of it in tournament play, but there's nothing wrong with using a hint or even a rocket if you need it. There are also bees, which we'll, we'll see later. I think they're called spelling bees. And there's also a way to place right here a bullseye. This allows you to tap a tile, and it'll reveal the letter under that tile. It's pretty much the same thing as a hint. You just get to select the, the tile, whereas the hint's going to put it wherever it wants to put it. Usually, it puts it at the beginning of the word, which is what you really need. So I don't normally use the bullseye that much. The bullseye is 200 coins, and the hint's 100, and the hint is usually enough for me. I'll use the bullseye when I'm low on hint, just as a replacement. 
I keep from having to spend coins, and these are just probably free bullseyes I've picked up in different ways, bonuses or whatever. The way I usually attack a puzzle, attack is a strong word, but the way I usually go at the puzzle is to just look at it and say, okay, well, here's free. That's pretty obvious. Freed. Oh, here's deer. You know, you can see obvious words. Deer is read backwards. And we got feed, fed. And then you start looking at fee. And at this point, I don't know what else is next. So I'll look up here and I see, okay, there's a D. Oh, that's a defer. I tell by the letters. The D gives me enough of a hint. There's red. It gives me enough of a hint. Ref is a, a pretty common word in these puzzles sometimes, although it's just a bonus in this one. Now, this is reef. It, it, did we get, I don't think we get reef yet. No, okay. So that's how I do it. I usually just pick out words I can see right off. And then I'll look at the puzzle and say, okay. By then I've got enough letters filled in to see some hints. Usually, sometimes it can get a little tough and I get stumped a little bit. Uh, spelled that wrong. Cones. Cone. Your son. Scone. That's a bonus word. Eon and eons. Nose. Cons. One. Ones. Once. Now this is all. I'm not even looking at the puzzle. I never even looked at the puzzle. I just looked at the letters and picked out the words I could see, and it was a pretty small puzzle, but it's good to complete it that way. And at this point, we've got enough to, to hatch an egg, so we'll, we'll do that and see if we can get another wildlife animal. There's a tiger, and that's going to give you stars, and that's something that you use in tournaments. Stars are pretty much tournament points. So. Unlocked Halloween portraits. I don't think I need that. Uh, it's it's swapped. I didn't realize it was swapping. I'm going to go back to the J because it it gives brilliance, and I don't I don't need tournament stars now. We're not in a tournament. Brilliance is always useful. Brilliance doesn't really mean much. It's just a measure of how far along you are. How long have you been playing? More or less. Some people may consider it a skill measure, but it's not really a skill measure. It's just really just a longevity. How long have you been doing this? And if you've been doing it a long time and you're way up, you have a lot of brilliance. You know, something. Uh, team owners or captains look at before they let someone come on the team. They usually have a minimum brilliance. And here's this again. All right. Not sure if this is a word. It actually is. Now, 
I know P is <laughs> kind of hinky, but it, I mean, it's a bonus word, so I'll, I'll take it, you know. <laughs> Uh, we is usually in, in here. There it is. You and you go different ways. I already got that one. Uh, I, of course, looking up at the puzzle now. Yep. Yep. And yup. Yup is not in this one, but if you have a you, that's a valid word. Getting tired of the ads. I want to get through some more of this and I'm going to switch over to my regular account, which I'm doing this on a desktop computer uh, in the BlueStacks emulator. You can't actually play Wordscapes on a computer natively. You have to use an emulator. So I'm using a An Android emulator, and it it's handy for some things. It's a little, it's just a little weird. I I don't know. I'm not I'm not crazy about it, but it was an easy way to get started with this. But I'm about to switch over to the phone and do more advanced play where I'm more advanced, and uh, I just wanted to get through some of this and kind of show how to get started with wordscapes. I'm trying to look at these words and see something. I see something right there. M-E-A-L. Oh, already got that one. Let's try it. Meld. As in Vulcan mind meld. <laughs> Mead. That's a good word. And metal. Yeah. It's going to go right there. And we got another word ending in D. I think I've already got lead. Nope, there's lead. I've already, already had it, but how about mail? All right. I think I've already got Dale. Dame. Lame. Hmm. Let's mix them up. See what we got. This is one of those situations where you, you look at it and you think, you know, I don't really know. A little bit stumped. I think I know what it is now, unless we've already got it. But I'm going to go ahead and watch another ad. I'll pause the video recording right here and come back when the ad is complete. We're playing word games, and I noticed that I couldn't help but notice that in this ad they spelled relaxing wrong. Real zing. <laughs> so let's get back to it. The ad's over. I got 40 coins for that watching that ad. That's not too bad. 40 is pretty good. I have seen as much as 300 from watching one ad. So it's worth it to watch an ad, you know, sometimes. And I think this may be made. Yes, it is. So 40 coins, that's good. We're up to level 79. And again, I'll look at the puzzle. 
I see year, Earl, ear, ear is another one, ear, R, and era. That's three words out of the same letters. You get I here, I and yay. Um, lay, layer, ray, real, rely, relay. Rye, lie, early, and that's it. Now, even if you pay, you're still going to see this every level. I want you to buy a piggy bank. I just don't have need for it. Here's some bees. Those are spelling bees. I'm not really sure how I got those. I don't recall. You see, they gave me some letters. And when I fill in these where the coins are, the, the, the coin sign, uh, the coin icon, I'll get coins immediately for those, one coin for each icon. So, again, I'm just going to look at what's here. And remember, yep, I told you about. There it is. Yep. Put pet. All right, I'm just looking through. Do you. I think I already have this as a bonus. Yes, a dupe. Here's die again. Now we have a longer word here that begins with a D. Here it is. Deputy. Here's another word that's a bit longer. Starts with a T, ends with a D. Let's move to this one, the short one. Give my brain a break for a minute. Duty up here. Ah, type, typed, and there it is. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, I can't remember the words I've already gotten. I have to go back. I can either look in the puzzle or just try them. Sometimes it's easier just to try them. Fire is a bonus word, so that's not that. Uh, how about right? No, nope, already got that. I must already have this as a bonus. I think I remember putting it in, yes. Hmm. Probably something really easy. How about this or this? 
Okay, folks. That should, well, I'm, I'll go ahead and open this binocular. See if I can get one more. Okay. Yeah, we've been playing for a few minutes now. I'm going to cut this off. Don't want to. Don't want to bore you for too long. Hope you enjoy the video. If you do, give me a subscribe. I'd appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next video.